Legend Race Cars. 30 laps to be the distance. What's the going? A to the outside, B to the inside. Here we go. Silas Hiscock goes around. Hiscock gets going. John Beatty Jr. to the inside. Kyle Elliott to the outside. All pace. As they race side by side, here comes Richie Davidowitz. Davidowitz, who had the first time here today, is to the inside of Elwood. Elwood tries to cross over Beatty. They're about to run into his cop. Kyle Elwood with a great move to come to the inside. Move Silas Hiscock up the raceway, and we'll go by. Good move by Elwood to come to the lead. Car number 88. Kyle Elwood, your race leader. Car number 25, Richie DeVito with second. Third is the eight car of John Beatty Jr. Fourth is car number five, George Tomko Jr. To fifth, car number 09, BVH, Brad Van Houten. Eight laps into this event. 30 to be the distance, and Davidowitz is starting to run in Elwood. flag down. Jonathan Parsons. Eight laps down. 22 remain for Kyle Elwood. Good restart for Elwood. Here comes the minutes. Big money. Feeling the heat to the inside from John Beatty Jr. Beatty. And looks to bring George Tomko Jr. with him. Tomko with a good run gets to the inside of Davidowitz. Tomko about to get a shove for Brad Van Houten. Van Houten to the inside of Davidowitz as well. Your last leader, car number 88, Kyle Elwood. To second, car number 8. John Beatty Jr. Third, car number five X, George Tomko to fourth. Car number zero nine, Brad Van Houten. Van Houten with a big move to the inside of George Tomko. And Van Houten will come to third. Bringing Davidowitz on the inside to fourth, your race leader Kyle Elwood. About to feel the heat at halfway from John Beatty Jr. Three to go. flag for Kyle Elwood. And for the 18th time in his career, Kyle Elwood will take down the win in legend competition.
Overhead Building Supply employee, Richie Davidowitz, who finished third, UPS truck driver, John Beatty Jr., Rockville Center Police Sergeant. Carter Wright, championship leader, and pretty much has secured your 2017 Legend Race Car Championship. He has a few races to go, but he got that big a lead. All right. Kyle Elwood rolls the victory lane. Let's go downstairs to Steve Halpern. Two races tonight, two top two finishes. Put some second all time. One win behind the Mac attack. Danny McNamara for career victories in Origin Race Car. Second in the white models, a win here. He got all the folks, big round of applause for Kyle Elwood. This guy's been dying on an Oscar on behalf of Ed and Connie Partridge and Tom Gatz like to present you with that trophy. Dying on a race car, had a couple of weeks off. People put their faith in you, put you in their race cars, you're second in the late model, and you win this race here tonight. What a job. Yeah, man, uh, I don't know how much of a better night you could ask for, but... Uh, well, two wins would have been better. I mean, yeah, we were pretty close. I mean, I, I'm still happy what we came home with with that deal, but I tell you what, this was probably an opportunity of a lifetime to be able to drive for a family like this. Um, Mikey asked me if I wanted to run the car for him, and you can't, you can't hesitate. You know, he's a great kid, and grandfather, you know, Buzzy, he's an awesome guy, and uh, we put this deal together, and we've been working on it for like a week and a half now, and we came out guns blazing, and... Uh, Car was a little off in practice today, but I tell you what, the feature this thing was on the money. I've never had a car like that on a long run. The thing just had drive, and uh, definitely a good car. It's for sale. I sold the last time, last time I won, so maybe someone wants to come and pick this thing up. It'll be over in the uh, in the pit area. But big, big, big thank you to Mikey and Buzzy Chew, Buzz Chew Chevrolet, Wachowski Farms, and everybody that put anything into this. It's, uh, it means a lot for people to put all their back into me just so I can come out here and do what I love to do. Even this year, we've had 35 different drivers run a legend car. You now climb to second on the list behind the all-time leader, Dan McNamara, who has 19 career wins. You have 18 career wins. If we can keep running this thing, it'd be some accomplishment if you can get ahead of him. I mean, that's, that's what my fire is set on right now. You know, uh, everyone has goals. I mean, some are bigger than others, but... Uh, I tell you what, I know Richard Davidowitz is close to me, but if I could just come and, and hit that, you know, I'll, I'll be the first guy in a long time. So uh, it'd definitely be a milestone for my career, so I, I'm, I'm, th I'm hungry for it. I want it. All right, folks, big round of applause for your race winner. Come on, taking down the win. Come on, suck at your point leader, John Bailey Jr. I'll tell you what, pal. We say it all the time. You're having a great time in this division. You got a great car. But, man, you are so smooth in this thing. You, you'll lose a couple of spots and get a couple of back. I mean, just a great job. Yeah, you know what's happened to all these young kids are kind of uh, have a little more endurance than I do. I'm getting old. <laughs> and, uh, no, having a really good time. I'm enjoying myself. And uh, I just like to thank everybody here at the track tonight, the officials, and uh, everybody who helps out this legend call. I really appreciate it. And uh, having a great time, man. I'm always smiling at this thing. All right, pal. Great job for John Beatty Jr., Connor Moore, your point leader, and Richard Davidowitz is back. Pal, you've had a rough couple of weeks here. One of them not even you're doing, but again, tonight you fell back a little bit, then worked your way back at the end. I mean, this car was real good at the end of the race. Uh, the car's been real good all day. Um, oddly enough, it just, the longer the race goes, the better the car gets, or, or maybe it's the better I get. I still haven't figured it out yet, but uh, the, uh, restarting on the top really hurt me. The car was too tight to be up top there to, to be able to uh, get a good run. How about some of the sponsors, people help, help you get here to third tonight? Uh, I got to thank Danny Jones from Blue Point Auto Body. He helps out a lot. Uh, he might possibly help me get to Vegas uh, so we could go do the, the uh, Las Vegas Nationals. I got to thank uh, Frankie from Thriftway Auto Body. And then a uh, big thank you to Jim White. He came on board for, uh, from uh, Hampton Fleet Service. All right, well, let's talk about that for a second. Anyone out here in the, in the stands that is interested in these legend cars that would like to get involved with a team, Richie Davidowitz is the representative from Riverhead Raceway who won the, the IMAX National Qualifier, his race is in Las Vegas. What type of money is it going to take to get you to Vegas? Uh, it's a minimum of five grand. Uh, I got a, a car rental lined up possibly, which will be about uh, 4000 and then a, you know, about another grand for uh, air, uh, travel, hotels, food, you know, the whole nine. And every bit can help you, right? So any, you won't turn any sponsor down. I won't turn anybody down. Anything helps. 
All right, folks, come see Richard the Venerant. See if we can help him out. See if we can help him get to Vegas. Comes home third here tonight in the Legend Race Car. Great job for Richard the Venerant in car number 25, who comes home third. Your second place driver, John Beatty Jr., and your winner, Kyle Elwood, here in the Legends, up next.